Hi, welcome back to Beam Design Studio, your go-to place for building smarter and designing better. In today's video, we are diving into the brand new features of Autodesk AutoCAD 2026. From enhanced automation tools to powerful collaboration upgrades, AutoCAD 2026 is set to transform the way we work. Whether you are a seasoned professional or just stepping into the world of design, there's something here for everyone. Let's dive right in. 1. AutoCAD Foundations a new learning course called AutoCAD Foundations is ideal for beginners or those who want to refresh their AutoCAD knowledge. This course begins with an overview of the AutoCAD user interface. It will show you how to annotate, hats, dimension, and more. It will also show you how to create and save drawings files and how to construct and change objects using simple commands. You can gain these abilities through a practical sketching of the square flange plate and house tech lessons. 2. Connected support files. Project aware support files are now available. This feature implies that a single set of linked support files can be shared by all drawings and project participants in Autodesk Docs. Let's go over how to configure Autodesk Docs project aware support files. Open Options dialog box, click the Files tab, and then select the setup. You can now configure your Autodesk Docs, Projects, Fonts, Plot Styles, Templates, and other support files. The same support files may now be used by all drawings and project participants without requiring separate setups. 3. Activity Insights We can quickly see what has changed in the drawing since we last worked on it due to the new Activity Insight, which displays an overview of revisions made by all contributors between saved sessions. A high-level overview of modifications and a workflow breakdown based on commands executed, edit time, and file size changes is provided by the Activity Insight when you click on a saved activity. This new Activity Insights feature improves teamwork and expedites processes. 4. Markup Import and Markup Assist Autodesk has kept improving the ability to improve and sync markups between Autodesk Docs and AutoCAD in this version. Now, Markup Assist can identify text, strike throughs, and boundary markups when you import markups from Autodesk Docs. 5. Furthermore, markups made on a PDF before its upload to Autodesk Docs may now be identified by Markup Assist. Only markups created in Autodesk Docs were identified in the prior edition. Additionally, AutoCAD can now examine issues made in Autodesk Docs. 5. Smart Block Search and Convert To make repetitious activities more efficient, Smart Block Search and Convert feature now detects text variants in addition to identical blocks. Let's use an office floor plan layout to test it out. In addition to the same items, all the cubicle numbers are recognized for block conversion after you choose the object and cubicle numbers and click Search and Convert. Sensing filters, viewing the total number of masked instances, navigating to the next or previous instance, and converting to block are all made simple by the new Search Review toolbar. Additionally, by selecting Define Attribute Tags, you may add a tag to the cubicle numbers. Six, Smart Blocks Detect and Convert. To look at more matching sets of objects for block conversion, Smart Blocks Detect and Convert feature has increased detection capabilities. All discovered sets will be displayed in the palette when Detect and Convert is finished. Convert the set to a block, alter or update the primary instance, go to the next or previous instance, or choose a set to view the total number of instances detected. Detect and Convert will find exactly what you are looking for due to the new edit main capability. Only I sections in our situation. Objects can be added or removed from the chosen primary instance. This will make your operations run more smoothly and refresh the block in the thumbnail. 7. Added layer option to center line and center mark. Autodesk added the center layer system variable to the processes for making new center lines and center marks in this version. We can modify the center layer system's value on the ribbon or add the command prompt. To see a complete list of new commands and system variables related to these new features, check out the official website of Autodesk linked below in the description. That's a wrap on the exciting new features of AutoCAD 2026. 
I hope you found this overview insightful and inspiring for your upcoming projects. If you enjoyed today's breakdown, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to BIM Design Studio and ring the bell so you never miss an update. Also let me know in the comments which feature you are most excited to try out. Until next time, keep building smarter and designing better.